You won't believe what Joe Biden said in a press conference today. Do you take any blame for inflation, Mr. President? I take any blame for inflation? No. Why not? Because it was already there when I got here, man. Remember what the economy was like when I got here? Jobs were hemorrhaging. Inflation was rising. We weren't manufacturing a damn thing here. We were in real economic difficulty. That's why I don't. Thank you. So you don't think your energy policy has anything to do with high inflation? Come on, man. Okay, maybe it has to do with the trillions of dollars you've spent since you've been in office. Come on, man. Okay, look here, Corn Pop. And Corn Pop was a bad dude. All right, guys, here's this chart. And Joe Biden, when he entered office in January 2021, by this red arrow, inflation was at 1.4%. It didn't start going up above 2% until March, and that it was 2.6% right here. And what does that coincide with? That's when they passed the stimulus package, which was 1.9%. And then it skyrocketed until uh, right up here where it got up to 1.9%, then it started going down. And the reason it started going down is because Joe Biden started releasing oil from the strategic oil reserves in order to lower gas prices because of election coming up. And not only did that lower gas prices, it also lowered the price of food at the grocery store because majority of food at the grocery store, it's delivered by vehicles that run off of diesel and gas. So I wonder what kind of argument Joe Biden has for that. More than half the women in my cabinet, more than, more than half the people in my cabinet, more than half the women in, the, in my administration are women. What the fuck are you talking about? 